guys, welcome back to another Steam Free to Play walkthrough. Today we have a demo for Mosca's Mask. Let's check it out. Uh, top one. That's got to be the play button, right? Oh, wait, there's a cog. Maybe I could have turned it into English. Uh, wait a second. What am I doing here? Oh, this is not the Jap English. Wait a second now. Let me try this again. Reload. It looks like it did have English from the. Um, on the preview I was looking at it, it looked like it was in English. I wonder if there's a way to put it in English. I hope so, that'd be really cool. If not, we're not playing it. <laughs> ah, yes, English, woo! Great, all right, new game. <laughs> all right, what are we doing here? Oscar's mask. Fire, where's here? Oh, heck. Oh, I'm a slidey boy. Damn it, hallucinations again! This is the punishment for me! Ah. I have to do something to solve it! Press buttons faster to, to solve? How to solve it? Can you solve it? Uh, of course I will. Please? Hopefully? This is a struggle? <laughs> okay. Let me up. Come here, Skull. Ooh. Come here. <laughs> God dang it. Oh, we did it. Oh, wait, we're still going? Oh, you suck. Yes, we got... Oh, it's getting me back. Uh oh, there's a white hair, dude. You couldn't really easily escape, did you? You were just deceiving yourself. You, you are the masked people. Oh no, Mufasa, Scar. I don't know, this reminds me of Lion King. Oh, all right. Oh, it's the, sis the sister. They look like twins. What's wrong, brother? Having nightmares again? Or it's okay, it's okay. Don't worry about me. Hi, brother. What's the matter with you? I've been feeling strange all around us since a week ago. Even you have nightmares and hallucinations. That was a pretty cool QTE event, though. It was pretty struggle. It's okay. I think it's just a little stressful. So are you college is stressful? So are you. College is stressful. Don't be paranoid. Body is more important than study. English isn't the first language, so I just bear with it. Oh, just don't talk about it. I've got breakfast ready for you. Come out and eat eat it later. I'm just gonna start correcting this in my head so it doesn't sound like that. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna try to anyways. My grammar's probably not as bad, but it's somewhere in there. But again, English is my first language and I suck at it too, so I can't blame someone. How do I move? Do I have to click? Okay, D and A. Space bar to go in here. My sandwiches are waiting for me. They need me. My sandwich is waiting for me still. Let's go this way. I wonder if <laughs> sandwiches can wait on. What are you doing? My sandwiches are waiting on me. Okay. <laughs> Suit has a one track mind for sandwiches. His eyes are kind of offside though, if that's what that is. All right, where's the sandwiches? My sandwiches are still waiting for me. What do I need to do to get your sandwiches? Ah, it smells so good. It, the, I am so happy to have breakfast made by my lovely sister in the morning. Don't make fun of me. It's just a sandwich. That was actually really good. I didn't have to... Uh, how happy I am. Um, um, delicious sandwich. Ah. Uh, what? Did you get into the show? Disgusting. Okay, I don't get that one. Your sandwich is gone. Ha 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 ha! Sorry, but I also want to create the warm atmosphere between brother and sister in the TV series. What what TV series? What are we talking about here? Come on, don't use that tone of... Come on, don't use that tone of baffling uh, weird joke on me. I don't know. Baffling joke. Ha <laughs> ha, but I am really praising you. Anyway... Whoever marries you in the future will be lucky. This conversation is super weird. Okay. 
Speaking of which, brother, I have a little thing to tell you. Oh, what's the matter? Not a big deal, I just thought I had to let you know. But... Hurry up, I'm still waiting for my breakfast. We just ate a sandwich, dude. The fact that... I'm in love. Huh? When did, it ha when did that happen? To who? How old? Male or female? How did you two meet? What is y'all's- what is your relationship? You... What can I say when you ask so many questions? We were in the same university, but not in the same college. We met at the school dance very early. Oh! Whoa! Oh man, I need to turn off- so that scared the hell out of me! Oh my god! Okay. Oh! He really cares about me! That scared me so bad. Oh my god. And then he confessed to me. Then that night he kissed me for the first time. He said he had made me his future wife. It's getting dark. How are you acting all normal when she just wigged out? Ah, oh, well. Anyways, be it as it may. We cannot assure, assure that he's only playing. Try not to be so serious. Too serious. I don't know what that... What? Do you mean I should put a little more effort into this? Not with the way you're acting right now. You need to calm down the effort. The effort needs to calm down. You're scared. You're scaring me. Because, brother... Because I think you're a little bit naive. In that case, I will ask... About his situation... Instead of our parents. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. What is his character? Uh, I have told you all the experiences. Should you know something? Do you want to know something? Uh, let's see if you can visualize it. Please don't visualize it. He's a little shy, but it's what makes him cute. Just like a puppy. I can't wait to tell you that. Can't wait to fill you in every time we go on a date. Oh, hang on, hang on. That means he's not happy? Sunny. Looks like that, but if you know him deeper, you must, you might find his passion. Ah, I see. Family's not very rich, are they? Um, uh, it's not as good as our family, but not very bad, though. That's a little vague. Alright, his family is a little harsh. His mom is in debt because of his business, but love has nothing to do with money. Anyway, with his ability, I believe that it will be no, won't be a problem much longer. Well, that's why I say you're naive, a naive child. There's a lot to think about. So, do you think there is nothing I ha haven't considered? There is something I have. I don't know. Do you think I'm and do you think I'm an idiot? I didn't say that. How many people are there in his family? No. What? What? How many people are just family? No! Okay. However, his father passed away when he was young. He grew up with his mother, and he started his own business in college. Uh, his dad died early? What's wrong with the single parent? Nothing really, but don't you think most people have issues with that or something? Issues after that or something? Huh. What do you mean, in fact? What do you even mean? I mean, like, bigotry, violence. Huh. I can't believe you should have such prejudice. But didn't you ever see the kids who have mental problems when we were young or even injuries? Hey, everyone will be mad if people around... What? Everyone around him considers him mad at the beginning and stay away from him. That's not what I meant. I do have some classmates with single parents. However, not only are they friendly, but they also do well in other things. Because nobody around them thinks they are strange. 
On the other hand, our parents return home once or twice a year. Are we different from the man with no parents, whether we are mad or not? You are mad. You are some strange child, children. At least you are, anyways. Okay, okay. Let's not talk about this anymore. Just like college lectures. I'm the one who made the mistake. Let's forget about it. You have a picture of him. I think it's fair to, for me to see what he looks like. Oh, wait. Oh my god, what is with these... Scary. I'm freaking out, dude. My dude's wigging out. Oh, why is this happening? This is crazy. Alright. This is an interesting game. He... What? Don't you think he's cute and handsome? What's the matter with you? Nothing. Just a little headache. More than a little headache. Are you hallucinating again? Yes. I'm okay. Forget about that. Anyways, I advise you break up with him soon. Huh? Are you kidding me again? I'm serious. For what? For all of his qualifications, I don't think you'll be very happy with him. Huh? Just by your character, I don't believe that you should interfere with my love for these things, my love for him. Besides, even if I agree to you two being together, I don't think our parents will agree when they come home. It's better to break up early than to suffer later. I do not understand why you became like this. Is it because you have been too stimulated by what happened to Sister Annie? Your sister Annie. How many times have I told you not to mention her name? I'm not gonna let you two get, get together anyway. Get together anyways. I don't need your approval. Not even parents. <laughs> My sandwich! Now! <laughs> it's gone! What do you mean it's gone? How did this happen? Not my sandwich! Forget about it. After these two days, there should be nothing to worry about. Oh, I'm out of sandwiches. Let me go to work. I have to go to my room and get my phone. I have to get my telephone in my bedroom right now. Right now. Okay. All right. Where would our stuff? It looks like a JoJo. It look, oh, he's a JoJo fan. Look at the bottom. Ha, huh, that's cool. That's definitely a JoJo reference. That's dope. Diary? Wall? Another p month passed. I don't want to stick with this job, and no matter how much I could earn. Ha, huh, I've already earned enough that I met her. She just left me, alone in tears, a whole night. Why not? Why don't I get better? Not too bad, and I have Ada anyway. I still have something to live for. It does annoy me for what Movon, that guy, could doubt about our brother-sister relationship. Pitiful little Molly, ostensibly under the care of brother like Ada. Little Molly's worries are written all over her face. I don't know what this is saying. Hope that little Molly can adjust her mind, get her head right. Listening to Mr. V Miss Vibia, I had no suspicious babe behavior of Dant. This man is really strange. Miss Vivia is still alone and taking care of Z. I, it's a little unsettling in every way. Catch a mouse hiding in a hole. Ha 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 ha. This might be the only one in the whole apartment. Really killed a big public nuisance. I can't let Ada know that there are mouse in the apartment. Ada always talks about moving out. Recently, she must have thought that a lot of strange things had happened in the building recently. And it is. But where is the no there nothing strange? I've been really tired lately. I've been hallucinating. Ah, but it's not normal to keep your spirits up like this. I can't make Ada worried. It looks like we really need to think about moving after it's all over. Ada's birthday is a, good, a week away. It should be a good idea to go to the mu amusement park. After all, even though she had been there so many times, she still ex looked excited every time. All the important things have to be done before then. Hallucinations are getting worse, and the psychiatrist seems unreliable. Hope my efforts can make me better, but even if it, they don't, I can't complain. But I had to try not to affect Ada. Hope the move will help her change her mind well. Alright, that's all of that. What's on our computer? I don't know. The gamepad of a new game console. PCS feels great. 
An ordinary sound box. I don't know the password to that. The head of the fraud usury extortion syndication or merge. Where would my phone be? There's a key right there. Can I grab that? No. Where where's our phone, my dude? I can't interact with anything. Am I doing something wrong? Oh, I know what I'm doing. Okay, I'm dumb. Got it. Give me that key. Get a key. Where is it? Oh, why is my cell phone ringing? Oh, it's just in my pocket. What's up, Wang? Hello? Hey, you are not on holiday, are you? No, I'm getting ready to leave. I'm sorry. I, I'm sure I won't be late. Oh, don't go to the office today. Huh? What's going on? I mean, weren't the residents of the building and the Resbud community reluctant to move? Yeah, we've tried to persuade, persuade so many times, so are we not- are we doing it again today? Yeah, but last month our colleague had it negotiated with most of the residents, and almost all of them have moved out. Now there's still one family who refuses to move no matter how hard we try. Which one? The old muses who live on the roof. I don't know what the reason is. It, it doesn't seem to be because of money, so it that it's hard to persuade. I this one impressed me deeply. Yeah, it's the first time I've seen an old couple with such a bad relationship. Anyway, we have to go back today and try to finish the job. Today? Yeah, I'm almost downstairs. I'll call you when I get there. All right, I'll wait for you. Wait for your message. Well, bye. Oh, bye. I don't know why Wayne has a deep voice, but this is really a diff little difficult. All right, first to go out. The pose of these figures seem to have the golden spirit, which makes people full of courage at the first sight. These three are my favorite RPG and horror games that have been specially purchased. My favorite comic series. All right, let's just go out, I guess. Oh, this door is open now. I have to go to work right now. Okay. We're going to work. Who are these people? What's up? What? I just saw Ada run out. And she looks very angry. What happened? Oh, nothing. It's a little thing. I had a little problem with my sister. Give more room to your sister and I'll never let Molly throw the door open and run out the door, will I, Molly? Oh yeah, Brother Mothabon. Oh, sorry, I I don't know what voice you should have. You should have an annoying voice. What's an annoying voice? So if you run after her now, she, you won't be far away and may be able to forgive you for your competence. But I'm going to work, and she's not the kind of person who likes to have a little temper. I think so. Oh my god, your sister is so angry that you want to go to work like someone else? How can you be a brother? That's an overstate, isn't it? <laughs> not to mention, approaching Mother Women's Day, I think would never let the younger sister happy is the responsibility of being a brother. You not only couldn't can't do it, also, don't want to make up for it. Fortunately, my Molly does not have a sister brother like you. What did you say? Is there a problem with what I said? What do you think, Molly? I asked, what do you think? Brother, I think you should stop talking. That's funny, I don't. That's enough. What, what do you and... What you do and what you think is no shit of my business. You don't want to get beaten up in front of your fucking sister. Shut your fucking mouth. Let's go. Sorry, my brother didn't mean that. Oh. Okay, I'm not going to do anything to your brother. I have to go to work. Yeah, bitch. Yeah, you better stop running your mouth. I have to go to work right now. <laughs> Told him. 
Good morning, Uncle Ayer. I just saw Ada go out in the huff. Is everything all right? Oh, nothing. I had a little disagreement with her about dating. It's no big deal. Well, it's normal for girls to fall in love at this age. I know, but there are some things I can't say. The girl at this age already had her idea, actually. Also have her distinguishing ability. Heart also is very exquisite, very sensitive at the same time. It is better to be able to have a more, little more trust and tolerance on the sister, a little le less limit and blame. Now why don't you restrict me? Huh. Then why did you restrict me from getting a girlfriend at school? Well, I'll deal with it carefully. Take a moment to have a quiet talk with her. By the way, this is a sandwich that Ada gave me to me. Said I'd give it to you when you came out. Oh, oh thank you. I finally got my sandwich, Miss Vivia. It's still hot. Eat it early. By the way, there's something I thought I'd talk to you about. Huh? What's the matter? Isn't that dance next door to me? Yeah, what's the matter with that gloomy freak who doesn't know what he's been doing all day? Is he installed a camera on our floor the other day and, and we found it. Is there such a thing? It may just be for safety reasons, but the thought of being photographed every day and opening and closing doors is nothing but unsettling. I don't know if he has any other camera in other places, but look, I'm a single mom, and you have a beautiful sister. No problem. So many people in our building take care of each other. Well, that's true. Relax. If something bad happens, you can ask us for help. I've rushed to work now. I'll see you later. Well, go ahead and remember to talk to Ada. Hi, Uncle Ayer. Get sandwich. Is that Dan over there? What's up, Dan? Why to meet this gloomy eccentric? Pretend not to see. Pretend not to see. There you go. Yo, hey, Dan, dude. There's. What can I do for you? What's the matter? For me, I'm all right. That. I'll just... But I think you might. Something's up. Me? What can I do for you? You in the heart certainly understand. This is not what children play the same trivial matter. Oh. Don't know what you're talking about. I don't either. I'm really in a hurry. I have to go. I'll tear the mask off your face myself. <laughs> Keep trying. Goodbye. Phone call, phone call. What's up, Wang? Hello? I'm out of your apartment. You can come out. Okay, I'm go- Oh, okay, I'm going out. I'm going out. How do I go out? Do I need to go this way? Wang is waiting for me. I have to go out. How do we get out? This way? This looks like the basement. Okay, 4961. Remember that, kids. 4961. I have to use the key. Okay, use the key. Why oh, can't I open? Oh, what's that? Oh, we're about to get got. Oh, hell no. Nah. Let's get out of here. Oh, like quickly. Oh! Oh! Oh my god, no! Oh my fucking god! Oh my! We're fucked! Oh my god, this is impossible. I don't have enough space on my desk for this stupid thing. Oh my god. Ah, you got me. Screw it. You lose! That's all that happens? Oh, okay, that's not too bad. I need- I gotta move my keyboard. I need more space on my desk for that crap. I keep getting to the end of my desk. Oh my god. Okay, let's try this again. What if I let go of the ball? Does it matter? 
Yeah, you can't let go of it either. That's probably another reason why I'm failing this. You let go of the click, you also fail, so you can't. That's crazy, dude. Yes! We did it! Oh my god, that was so hard! I cannot... I'm glad that there's like multiple neat mechanics in the game, like mini games and stuff, but that kicked my butt so hard. Oh my lord. What's up, Wang? What's up, Wang? Here you are. Well, well. Hey, what's wrong with you? Me? I'm fine. You look terrible. Nothing, but I almost fell down when I went downstairs. You are so active in your work. Attach importance to safety. Yeah, I know. It's getting late. Let's go. Ding a ling. On phone. Hello? On phone. Well, this is. On phone. Eh? Now? On phone. Oh, I see. Something wrong? Well, I, well, you might have to go alone. Uh, why? The company just gave me an important assignment. I... Alright, you go. I'll go alone. I'm sorry. Let's go to barbecue another night. Never mind. Both to work. Well, I'll go now. Okay. By the way, let me tell you something. What? That amuses couple, they're tough. Why do you think so? Nothing, but just a little weird. Weird? Oh, I don't know. Feelings, just feelings. Well, then let me know if you st see something is wrong. Think something is wrong. After all, the, this family has a lot to do with our performance. Of, co of course. Anything else? No, you can go ahead. Well, goodbye. Bye. Hi, Wang. Just abandoning me like that? Oh, I see how you got important stuff to do and you just sit there? Okay. Interesting. Let's go to the Rosebud community. I have to go to work. That's a kitty cat. Oh, what's that? Stop! Oh. Stop! Another one. I'm glad I got here in time. You are? Must be Miss Anne who have thrown it again. Miss Anne? Ah, uh, why do you... Does this one scratch people? What do you want? Come on, let the qu cat be quiet. Why should I? Leave the cat alone, that's what she meant. Cut the crap, come on. I give a shit about this cat. I'll kick this cat halfway across the building. Ah. Oh. Heh <laughs> What am I supposed to do here? Why? Oh my god. This kitty cat. Please, kitty cat. Fuck this cat. Oh my god. There's like a pattern of this, but I do not know it. You have anything to feed him? I have a sandwich, but... But what? Take it out. You want the sandwich? You fat thing? I like sandwich. You better not. Fuck you up. Eat all the sandwiches then. I don't care. Eat them. Eat, enjoy the sandwich. 
Am I just supposed to feed him the sandwich now? Is that all we're doing here? Because now everything I do pisses him the hell off. Whatever. That's good enough, right? Happy? Oh, screw this cat. Oh my god, screw the cat. Do I have to- do I have to appease the cat to move on? Let me help the cat first, no! Oh my god, please no! Oh my god. I don't understand what I'm supposed to do here. He just eats the sandwich and that's it. Gotta poke him in the eyes. Ah, oh, you gotta pet him while he's eating the sandwich. Screw you, cat. Oh my god, screw you, cat. This cat pisses me the fuck off. I can't, can't explain how mad this cat makes me. Oh my god, please. Yes, he calmed down. Thank the Lord. Oh my god, that cat is the devil. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's done. Oh, by the way, his name is Jerlin. Thanks for helping me. You're welcome. My name is Air. Why can't you sue the cat when you're so good at banging it? In fact, it was Hetty at first, and the ones that were quiet before. The ones before? By the way, you just said that Miss Ann threw it down. What's going on? In fact, the, in fact, the poor cat must have been thrown from the balcony by Miss Ann. Why would she do such a thing? I don't know why she would. All I know is that not long ago, Miss Ann started throwing straight house off the balcony. <laughs> Why? I happened to see it. I happened to see it once, and then whenever I passed by and happened to see a cat that had had a fall, I banished it. But in my memory, Miss Ann is a very kind old woman. Every time I see her, I can feel the difference between her and most old ladies. Difference? My impression of Miss Ann is of a. Always very polite to people. Talk is not the kind of elders to junior tone. She doesn't talk down to people, I guess. I went to the couple's house many times to persuade them, and she and the couple, elderly amused, never agreed to move, but they always respected us. This is especially true of Miss Anne. How could a pious, graceful, and gentle old woman like her do this? It's really like her personality. Isn't it? She did resemble what you described. Did? Yes, yeah, she was such a popular person, and people around her said much the same about her. Lately, however, she had suddenly become restless and rambling for no reason. Not only did she quarrel with her husband every now and then, but she also started abusing animals in the neighborhood. Especially black cats like this. As soon as she saw him, she would lure him upstairs with dried fish and throw him down without hesitation. Is that so? How come I didn't realize that she was such a person? I don't know. By the way, how can you be so sure? As far as I know, the residents of the Rosebud community have basically all moved out, leaving only the Amos family determined not to move. Why do you come and go so often and know so much about the couple? What are you up to? 
How about just because I'm their granddaughter? Any questions? No. Oh, oh, I see. I was rude. I'm sorry. What about you? What did you say you were doing? Getting her to move. Oh, the I'm here to talk about re relocation terms. Recently, our company wants to acquire this piece of land for a new project. The Rosebud community is also planned. Basically, with all the residents have talked about relocation conditions, and they have moved out. Only the Amos and his wife. It's no use, my grandpa is such a stubborn person. What do you mean? He has lived in this neighborhood for most of his life. Even if my parents call me every few days to pick them up and leave, live in my house, they won't agree. They won't let, a, let alone move out. But this is a difficult time for our company. If this project fails, I'm afraid we might have to murder them. Then you better persuade them yourself. I'm sorry, I might not be able to help. So is your position in your agreement? That's not what it means. But if they agree to move, they'll probably agree to move into my house. After all, it's hard to tell that people like you have a heart for helping animals. No, that animal made me help it. I did not want to help it. Oh, I didn't mean anything by that. Sorry. Ha ha ha, it's okay. Well, I was thinking of my sister. If she was here, she'd be happy to do this too. She, she must be a very kind girl. Okay, go ahead. They're 404 on the fourth floor. Well, I've been here several times before, and maybe I'll come again. Maybe I'll see you again. With Kuro-chan? Is that what we're naming him? What? Why did you take the name liberty of naming it? Because it's a black cat and Kuro means black? Oh, I'm sorry. I just think it's... Clearly called Xiao Hei. More lovely. That's a Chinese name. Well, good luck anyway. Well, goodbye. Go ahead. Go ahead, good luck. Alright, thank you. Alright, what are we doing now? Oh, that dude's hanging in that photo. You see that? That's crazy. Hmm, this is a bad sign. I'm flickering. Oh, I'm a skeleton, man. Let's go. Can I jump or anything? Nope, just skeleton up on the stairs. Spooky, scary skeletons should shivers down your spine. These uh, stairs are really taking it out of me. Oh, whoa. Did it glitch? I can't even go backwards. Okay, I can't go backwards, but we can go forwards. We got four more floors to go. Uh-oh. What is going on here? This is getting crazy. This is a really neat game. I wish the subtitles were a little bit better. But it's pretty cool. I like how it has like different mini games and the art style is really freaking dope. It's really confusing, but really dope. Go, 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 go. All right, now we got more, more stairs. Stairs for everyone. Boing, 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 boing. 404, room not found. That's not the English. Uh, they're quarreling. This is bit my bad luck. No way, the project is the last straw for our company. I must finish it. I gotta clear my throat, I'm done. The, I was here before. It's Iyer. Is anyone home? Oh. Excuse me. Oh. What's up, ma'am? I need to... Talk to Miss Ann first. That I'm Miss Ann? Who are you? Oh wait, maybe I have to talk to her from this side. In fact, the purpose of my visit is still... Ha ha ha, what I'll have to say, I know, is for the matter to move to discuss with us, right? Oh. Yes, ha ha ha. You have come so many times for this, and it is really very hard. No, no, it's just work. 
I actually like young people like you, in fact. Haha, -ha, that's very kind of you. It's like having a grandson who comes to see us every now and then. Even if my attention was to move you? Haha, <laughs> I feel a little ashamed though. You'll be honest, after all the neighbors have moved out, you'll be the only one to see me, apart from my granddaughter. Oh, and then Mr. Wang, he's been here several times, is he your colleague? Yeah. I don't like him very much, though he is also a young and energetic man. You make me happier than he do. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> you, you as well. You also make me very feel very nice, I guess. Kind. Now that you know why I'm here, I'll get straight to the point. Well, after the consultation of the senior management, our company is willing to pay 30% more than what we proposed last time. Oh, don't put all your mind on your work. Why don't you sit down and have a chat first? What do you say? You sit down, there's no tea at all. I'm going to buy some tea and some fruit. We can have a nice chat. Oh, don't bother. I was in such a hurry when I came here, I didn't bring anything with me. Now, how could I bother you? No trouble. I was hoping you'd stay a little longer. I'm going out. But... By the way, you can walk and talk to Amos while I'm out. Is Mr. Amos in his room? Well, you know, he can't even get out of bed and walk. Where else to go but lie down in the room? And now he doesn't seem to want to see me very much. Just have a chat while I'm away. But first, neither he nor I want to move. After all, we've lived here most of our lives and Amos is an old man who can't walk. In fact, the most important is that he is as stubborn as a bull. You had better be prepared for it. I have confidence. In fact, I think privately if we never move, will you always come to see us like this? Ha <laughs> ha You are so good at joking. Ha ha ha! Then I'll go. Oh, by the way. Is there anything else? Ammo seems to care a little about a recently thought out board game. If you want to make him feel better, you can think about it with him. Oh, I see. Then I'll go. Bye. Well, take your time. I can feel a board game mini game coming about. I'm ready. Up with this eyeball on the carpet, that's kind of weird, right? I have to talk to Amos. Where is Amos at? It's locked. That's obviously not Amos' room, then. Alright, Amos, you ready? Oh, Amos is kind of creepy looking, ain't he? Kind of chess I have never seen. Seems about cat and mice. Weird. Isn't it this I you Come to see me, old. Come to see this old man today. You have trouble walking, and the environment is so lonely. So I came to see you. Thanks. After all, it is the young man who is more vivacious than the stuffy lady in this house. Then why don't you move in with Geraldine and her parents? Peace of mind to enjoy family happiness. I think it is also very good. Oh, so you guys know each other? Well, I happen to know her. Aha! Uh -huh, things are not so simple in our family. Do you think the child would have come to a, us in a place like this if her parents had not asked her to? But I think she's a very nice, kind child. Of course she is! Oh, by the way, you're just in time. I need you right here. Huh? Could you bring me a pair of chests from the table over there? Yes, I can! Grab that chest. Get Amos's chess. Hi, right, Amos, I'm ready. This is the chess you wanted? Thank you. I read this newspaper the other day. Oh? The latest papers besides reporting housewives or hostesses or people killing themselves or tracking down criminals would publish such interesting things. Like this one. It's a very simple game called Mice Eat the Cat. I see the cat, that's backwards. Well, it's not a really complicated game, but I'm interested in its little story. The description says that a black cat was very good at catching mice when he was young, but he became very weak when he was old. 
At the same time, two strong mice, one black and one white, joined hands to eat the old and weak black cat. But these two mice have strange habits. One of them, the black mouse, could not walk in a straight line when will only reach the destination by detours. And the white mouse resolutely refused to turn back. No matter what, will do not retreat. The black cat was badly hurt and could only move in, about, it, in a, about in its shelter. The two mice had to find a way to eat the black cat in a shelter. Haha, <laughs> what an interesting story. So how to play the chess? The grid on the chessboard represents the range of movement. And the cat can move around in the black area one grid per turn. Interesting. Like he can only move in the shelter? The black mouse can go only two grids in a straight line and then turn. And go one grid at a time in the vertical direction. Or, okay. Detours, that's what it means. Finally, the white mouse. It can move one grid at a time, but it can never move backwards. Never turn back. If a piece is covered by another piece, it is eaten. In the beginning, the positions of the three pieces were specified. If the mouse could kill the cat or drive him to the wall within three steps, the mice would win. On the other hand, if both mouse were eaten by the cat or the cat was cornered within the three steps, the cat won. I get it. So dude, will you play the next two games with me? I'd love to, but since... What? No. Who win? Why not play it with Miss Anne? She can't play chess with me, or rather, I'd like to see if the mice in your mind has the means to eat the cat. Oh well. Let's start. I'll play the cat, you'll play the mouse, and see how you can drive me to the wall in three steps. I'll... I'll do my best. Okay. Oh, uh, if I move up, then we'll get eight. Oh, that's so good. Actually, that's just fine right there. Oh, wait. No, that's not good. I already lost. The hell. It seems like that you're still in lack of... Okay, let's play it again. Alright, I'm ready. Damn it. This is hard. I gotta do something with the white mouse. Oh, he can't move diagonal though. Ah, I didn't know that. Oh, I won. I don't know how I won, but... It's you! And how are you going to eat me up in this situation? Oh, it moved around? Alright. Interesting. Crap. Seems that you haven't got the hang of me eating you yet. Do I have to start all the way over? No. Okay. I feel like the black mouse is useless. Oh, never mind. Ho oh, ho ho, the mouse can eat the cat, isn't it? I guess, dude. Whatever, it worked. Ha ha ha, yes. So can we get down to business now? Well, although I know why you're here, all right, go ahead. As you know, our company had a little trouble recently. I'm not in a position to say. Generally speaking, this project is about the life of our whole company. So what? After leader, our leader's discussion, we will provide 30% higher compensation and follow-up services than the last proposal. Please, this is about the lives of hundreds of employees, so... 
So you're asking me for the lives of a hundred employees, or for the leaders of in your company, or for yourself, or for your family? It's just my work. So you mean you need my sacrifice to save you guys? I'm so sorry. Oh! However, we will provide compensation accordingly. And you can live with loved ones. Sacrifice. This word is too. Oh yes, that's the idea. What a pity. So could you please think about it? You don't need to give me an answer right away. Discuss it with Miss Anne. So that's what you're here to talk about. Just so. Yeah. I, th I thought well prepared. I'm really sorry. This time it's actually a temporary visit. Next time you will see a complete plan. I promise. Well, last uh, young people's drive is really not to be underestimated. It seems that I do not have much time to stay here. Uh, uh oh. What's the matter? Are you feeling sick? Head, a sudden headache. Oh, an ambulance! It's okay. Old problem. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Go? Oh, where can you go when I'm watching? Oh. You what? I need to get out of here. Oh, I'm so slow. Oh, run, baby. Move. What are you doing? Get going. What is this, like red light, green light? Oh, okay, I got it. Red light, green light, baby. I'm a master at this. You're never gonna catch me. Get out of here, son. God, he got me. Oh my God, okay. takes patience and I do not have it. Oh my fuck, oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> oh, frustrated. You just move so slow. It's so frustrating. <laughs> oh, it's the slowest red light, green light ever. I think two steps is a good number to take if you can help it, because it's not worth resetting. And I think that's like the shortest span is two steps. This one out. I'm gonna be so tilted if he gets me. Oh, time consuming. If I was more ballsy, this would not be too bad, but it's not worth restarting now. Too deep. Can 
I get out of here, please? How close do I need to be to the door? so far now I can't watch my character move and watch him at the same time it's kind of concerning that's why you notice I'm not taking as many steps are you all right no uh, I feel dizzy just now it's an old problem it's all right it's not all right you're too tired you just need a good rest I need you to stop going all demon on me well then I'll I'll go now Jesus Christ, let's get out of here. Actually, let's see. Never mind. There doesn't seem to be much um, stuff to exploring around. Oh! Ah! Oh, what's up? I just brought some fruit and cut it off for you. I I'm leaving. Sorry to trouble you. What's the matter? Don't you want to sit and have a rest? No, we're done. I'm not going I'm not going to go on bothering you. Did the old man do something strange to you, please don't mind. No no no, it's not just that I'm suddenly under the weather. That take care of your health. Many young people are exhausted by their hard work these days. Don't worry, I'll see you later. She does have that knife in her hand though. Take care. Don't you stab me. Oh, I feel like she's gonna take off running after me with the knife. Okay, she didn't. Good. It goes on. If it goes on like this, how do, can I keep going? Demo's over. Please wait for Maska's mask. Alright, I do like the game. I like it, but I just wish the dubbing was better, or the subbing, because it kind of ruins the story when I'm having to like piece together what the characters are trying to say, but it does seem super interesting and I really like the like the animation and the drawing and the illustration. It looks really cool and I like the mini games as well. Overall, it's a pretty good game. I just really wish um, the English was a little bit better, but I understand it's not their first language. It's, pro it's really good for not being their first language. But if you like gameplay like the like this, please like and subscribe. I do a bunch of videos like these, and I'd love more than love to have uh, people coming and comment, and always enjoy interacting with people. Bye.